what is up everybody jordan here i wanted to come on here and just kind of tell you where i've been where i've been physically where i've been mentally and just all over the place uh, my last video i made was april 10th i believe april 10th something like that so about two months ago and literally in two months a lot has happened obviously we were still dealing with the whole coronavirus pandemic on our hands and the stock market just crashed in March um, and slowly was kind of recovering throughout April. Now we are in June. It's June 10th. Let me make sure I'm right because time flies. So yeah, it's June 10th right now as we speak and man, how crazy has it been just to kind of take everything in that's honestly why i kind of stopped making videos was to take everything in and just absorb everything i don't even know how to explain it like this just was crazy so i kind of took a little break but i plan to you know slowly make more videos as for like where i've been i've honestly been pretty busy with work um and very blessed to to be busy with work as uh, if you don't know I am a real estate agent and I have a little detailing company so I uh, detail cars and I uh, help people buy and sell houses so pretty crazy job to do I'd say um, self-employed so honestly when the whole coronavirus did hit uh, my businesses did take a take a pretty big jab and I was pretty dry for like a, that whole like that first week I'd say um, from when it like all went down and the whole news was all over it like everybody was just cooped up in the house like scared like just so much fear and i i just i kind of was just like wow and i was taking everything in for that week and business was so slow and then it slowly started to pick back up and i was very fortunate to receive all that business so i've just been busy with business detailing cars selling houses i actually closed on a house in april i'm working on some some more transaction that, as we speak and just trucking along so that's kind of where i've been i would say like physically um mentally with the whole black lives matter um i am very as an african-american uh, man growing up in america um i am 19 years old if you don't know i turned 20 in july but it has been a very big problem in america i've never really been out of the country well i've been to mexico for like a little vacation but I've never lived out of the country shall I say so I would say um, it definitely is a huge problem in America and especially the whole police brutality uh, you know me being pulled over by an officer that's white and even having that thought that like I could lose my life is pretty serious so we needed to address that uh, is pretty much what we've been trying to do this whole time and um I'm, i definitely love i love what's going on in the world um as for like the rioting and looting I, that's kind of crazy but uh, if we've been peaceful protesting for how many years this is what gets your attention then you must you got to do what you got to do i mean if, if you are a father or a mother and you found out your son or daughter was killed by police that was supposed to save their life, um, I'm pretty sure you would be upset. So it's not an excuse, but it's like a wake up call. Like, come on guys, we're in 2020. Why is this shit still happening? Um, that's where I've been. So why I even make these videos is to invest and show you guys my opinion on investments and show my perspective on different topics in the whole investment world and the financial world so i've been obviously investing heavily um from all the business that i've been getting which i'm super fortunate and just doing all that man so it's a lot you know to take in and try to make time for i i wouldn't say i don't have time to make the videos i just haven't made time to make the videos so i want to start to make more time to make these videos because i really do enjoy making the videos so yeah that's where that's where i've been um where my head has been in these last few months um 2020 has been a crazy year and to just think that we're literally six months away from 2021 is honestly insane to me um <laughs> it's pretty crazy just to just as even say that like 
we're so close to 2021. Um, 2020 has been a crazy year, and we're only halfway through it, so who knows what the next chapter of 2020 will be, but um, I definitely did not expect all this to happen, but hey, that's life, you know, life, you know, gives you lemons, you turn into lemonade, so a little something somebody told me, but yeah, um, I do want to make the investment videos, I want to show you guys what I've been doing with the portfolios, um, just a little sneak peek, I actually sold all of my M1 Finance portfolio, I know you're like, oh, you sold, but um, I sold out of all those, though. I think it was like uh, $900 or so. So I sold all of that and I actually transferred it to my Robinhood account. I could have done what's called like an ACATS transfer, if anybody knows what that is. Um, but I believe they would have took like $75. So I just sold. I might get, I don't even think I'll probably get hit on the back end with the taxes because I was down. So yeah. So I went ahead and sold the M1 Finance portfolio. Who knows? I might funnel more money into it uh, later down the road, but... I saw such a huge opportunity in um, one company in particular. So I, I took that opportunity and literally as I'm making this video today, guys, Tesla stock um, hit its all time high. It, it crossed over $1,000 per share. If you go back a couple videos uh, in my channel, I don't even know when uh, my first Tesla video I made, but man, I've been in this stock for a while. And I just saw such a huge opportunity and everything was just lining up perfectly. So I sold out the M1 Finance portfolio and bought some more shares of Tesla. And I've just been buying Tesla, honestly, um, for the past couple months, just been buying Tesla stock. So I'll go ahead and make a video on that later. But that's where I've been, guys. That is that is what I've been thinking, what I've been going through. Um, I want to get back on here and make some more videos because I do enjoy this. This is this is pretty fun to me. It's been it's been a crazy journey. Everybody stay safe out there. This is a crazy world we are living in. That's all I can say. And I'm very optimistic. I would say that about everything that's going on. I'm very optimistic about the future and about the people um, that I'm seeing, at least on the social media side and actually in real life. Like um, I've seen a change. And that's all I can say. Um, I've definitely seen a change. And it's, it's just like a wake up call for everybody. Like, you know, and we've dealt with a lot of shit in the past and I'm glad that we're able to to just take care of what's been years and years of pain um, and just slowly just start to address that stuff because it's serious and it's real um, so yeah super happy I hope you guys are staying safe I hope you guys are doing good and uh yeah guys i'll see you guys in that next video stay tuned boys and girls smash that like button subscribe and peace